All right, hey Alfonso. All right, so today I decided I'd just try some uh, like really old uh, internet games, like Flash games, Shockwave games. Actually, I think a lot of these are just Shockwave games. I don't think a lot of these are Flash. Um, Shockwave was kind of an interesting technology. Um, too bad it was like not secure. It had like major security issues, but it was neat. It, um, Anyway, um, so these are from Hello back in the day. Um, here, I need to get my volume adjusted here. I think it's like really, really loud right now. This might be good. Okay. Did you ever play Candy Stand, Alfonso? Well, was that like before your time? I'm not sure. I decided to start out with like the classic game. That I, like, I remember when, uh, never heard of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, this was around in about the late 90s to maybe the mid 2000s. Actually, I think it stuck around until like the late 2000s, even, but by that point, it already like. It's, it's heyday, it already long since passed, you know? Um, and it was sort of like, it was just, uh, a place for kids to go and play lots of little simple games and stuff for fun. Um, and they got to advertise their candy and junk food and stuff to them. <laughs> little, these are a little bit evil the way I described it, but, I mean, it was, it was really fun, so. Actually, I got two 100 point, uh, Oops, this time. That's interesting. What was my score again? 280, huh? Yeah, it was really cool. Um, for some reason, it's this type of stuff. Um, this was like, this is like mobile games before mobile games, right? And, uh, I remember anytime I could go to the library, or anytime we ever went out of state to visit my grandparents or whatever, they had internet, and I'd I'd be so excited to like play Candy Stand. Um, but every time I'd see it, you know, it'd be like months or even like a year or more each time I'd see it, and it would change so drastically. They'd have like new games or they would take old games away, and I'd be like, hey, where'd my where'd this game I love go? I don't know. Um. Such early, early days for the internet, though. Wow, that really was lousy. Flash, Flash and Shockwave are gone now. I don't know if HTML5 has really uh, replaced it. I mean, I know it has. But I mean, as far as, like, I don't think they're ever gonna, it's ever gonna be, like, a big rush of, like, people trying to make games and stuff on the internet like there was back then. Yeah, rip, rip, exactly, rip Flash games. Did you ever have any favorite Flash games you liked? Um, my family, we didn't get the internet until 2002. I, actually, I did play Candy Stand at that point, too. Sometimes. But, yeah, I mean, there were so many Flash websites by that point, And it was just big business, man. I don't think there's such a thing anymore. I think, like, all the people who would have done the Flash games, uh, play the all-time library. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, I know. Exactly, the same experience. Um, it was, it was so wonderful. Anytime, it was, the internet was, like, the most magical thing when I was a child. Um, talking when I was, like, 10, 11, 12, or something, I don't know. Um. I see, I see. I could probably look up what the most popular Flash games ever were, and you probably know a lot of them, but... Also, I could probably 
get some background music on. Because a lot of these games don't have any music or anything. You know, it's to save on bandwidth and everything, so... Uh, there's gonna be lots of dead silence if I don't put on some music. Cool. That actually wasn't too bad. Okay, um, actually I think my best score was 280, which is not spectacular. But it's better than I usually do. Um, let's see. So the big thing that Candy Stand was famous for was its many, many, uh... Mini golf games? Just let me see. Which one would be the first one? Would it be this? Would it be that one? I don't know. Anyway, let's just start this one up. Looks like it has the oldest logo. Oh, there's some background music. Damn. Let me get this window adjusted here. Is it going to fit the whole... Oh, it is. Or just about the whole uh, screen. About. Oh, it actually does. It's like the perfect uh, 16 by 9. I didn't even realize it was 16 by 9. Now, my screen, it's going gonna, it's gonna to look way bigger on your screen than it does on my screen. It looks tiny to me. But, uh, let's see. What course to do first? And this one looks colorful. Lifesavers Fusions, huh? I'm sure that doesn't exist anymore. Whatever that is. Lifesavers Fusions. I, was, I, don't, I don't think I've ever seen that at the store any time lately, so... What the heck? You gotta be kidding me. I got a hole-in-one on complete accident. Wow. That's insane. I usually don't do great at these games. Uh... Okay, then. <laughs> okay, then. I usually do terrible at these, but... Oh, look at that. The Lunchables kid. I remember that from, like, those commercials back in the day. Wasn't it, like, Claymation, I guess? Like, yeah, I think so. Or something... Maybe it was made to look like... No, I think it was, like, CG kind of looking like Claymation or something. I don't know. I wonder if there's just, like, a special way to get a hole-in-one in every course. I don't know. Now, I, I, th I would think I want to bounce it off of this wall over here, and then it'll, it'll go back towards the red slide, right? This may be completely ignorant, but we'll see. Oh, there we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. No, wait, wait. I, I, I'm making a bad shot. Oh, well. Uh, oh, get in there. No. Too bad. Am I still on par? I don't know. We'll find out in a second here. No, I'm above par and sucks, bogey. But that's my that's the usual experience for me. Usually, I can take upwards of like ten, 10 shots. Oh come on, that looks ridiculous. I think I kind of remember those. What, like those little mascot, whatever the hell things are over there. It's like disembodied children's head heads over there. No, 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 no. I don't think you want them to be run over because I think they, your ball gets deleted if it gets run over. So I'm going to just try to smack it over there as fast as possible. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, wait, wait. It doesn't get deleted. Oh, but I got knocked out of the damn. He's advertisement. Yeah. Um. Everybody's everybody loves cheese, right? Except for my wife. Dang it! No, 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 no. I'm really sucking now. But this is the normal experience for me. Okay, just get it out of here. I don't want to hit it as hard as possible. I just want to hit it kind of hard. 
There we go. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know, where are you from, Alfonso? Like, you're from, from America, I assume? Um, yeah, yeah, California, you remember you said that? Um, they say that other nations' cheese is way better than Americans. Oh, shoot. They say that, uh, like, British cheese and stuff is, like, really, really good. Oh, this course. I remember this. This one's evil. Like, these freaking gummy worms. Oh, man. Because they use actual milk. Do they not use milk in cheese here? Doesn't seem right. Oh my gosh, I, I avoided all of them. How? I'm getting so lucky a couple times tonight. Well, that sucked. But. I guess I didn't get knocked around by the stupid worms. Hit it. Hit it, dang it. Why are you not hitting it? This thing refuses to hit the ball now. Uh, why is it not working? I can't make contact with the ball anymore. That sucks. Well, let's go back to the menu. Um... Really? Cash singles can't call themselves cheese, really. Yeah, I've had some of this stuff like fake cheese product. And seems like the the faker it is, like the more horrible it is. For real. Yeah, crafts are exactly. I guess so. I guess you got a point there. Hey, Kool Aid Man. I guess whatever company makes lifesavers makes a whole bunch of different junk food products. I just didn't realize that they were all in one company. Get in there. Yeah. Sweet. Just below par. Umbrella Corp. Yeah, possibly. Um. So what do I want to do next? What's this? Dream Savers. Oh, that's interesting. I gotta make a jump, looks like. I gotta make a jump or something. I think I have to bounce it off of that cream saver up there, right? Do they still make cream savers? I swear that's like not a thing anymore. Well, that sucked. That was a complete waste. Uh, let's try this. And I threw it down the hill. Okay, cool. How about I just smack it up there a little bit? Yeah, I'll just do that. All right. Into this thing, and now it's going to happen. Oh, shoot. You have to be so precise with that. Get in there. This was very bad. Bad score. Seven. Oh, they still make them, huh? Cool. Remember the old commercials and stuff? They were like... I mean, actually, they were for Lifesavers first. It was like, you know... Life Savers. Yum. Oh. 
Sorry, it takes me back every time I see that. Oh, really? Discontinued for 10 years, brought back in 2021. Well, didn't know that. I think I still see bright octopuses around every once in a while. But it's, it's pretty rare. Alright, smack them. Smack it. No, wait, wait. Oh, actually, I don't want to hit it to the... <laughs> Do I just got I just gotta wait here until I see the pinnacles go up, I guess. Go, 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 go. No. Come on. Jeez. I gotta had three shots there. Which is the par, but I went as above par, oh well. What's this one? Oh, that's... Oh, man, I remember these. Oh, gosh. There's something you'll never have again. Yeah, I got... Well, see, that's the thing. I try to tap it in, but then it won't go far enough. So I try to use a little bit more power than what I think is a tap. And then it goes too far. Yeah, it's a little... <laughs> and once you... also, once you dedicate... Once you, uh, cause basically you just click the mouse button for as long as you need to. If you put too much power in, you can't undo that much power. There's no way to like cancel your stroke. I think, I think you, ha I think you're, once you're committed, you're just committed. So be very, very precise. Let me see if I can get some music on here. This might be nice. There we go. Oh, that's a Happy Gilmore quote, I see. I haven't seen that movie in forever, man. Um... Oh, what the? Oh, you have to make it underneath there or something. It's hard to judge, though, because, you know, it's like a, it's not like a GIF, but you know what I'm saying, like a, something that's like a 3D object, but it's not, it's not actually 3D, oh, pre-rendered 3D, dang it. See, that's what I mean, once I'm committed to putting in my full power, like, I'm just stuck doing it. Oh yeah, absolutely. When you rewatch these movies, yeah, they, they got tons of adult jokes you didn't catch as a kid. What well, I'm gonna think of like what's another example of like something I I completely forgot when I was a kid. I didn't understand as a kid. Oh yeah, Ghostbusters. You know the scene with like the ghost uh going down on Ray or whatever? Like when you're a little kid you have no idea what the hell that's about. Oh, perfect! I wish I could have gotten that the first time. I don't think it's... Is it possible to get a hole-in-one on this course? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. I mean, I, when I was a little kid, I watched Ghostbusters over and over. And I'd see that scene all the time, but I didn't understand it at all, you know? And then when I saw it again as an adult, many, many years later, I was like, Oh! Oh, I get it now. Well, Fruity Pebbles... So this is Post? Wait, is, is Lifesavers owned by the Post brand or whatever? Or is Post brand owned by them? Whatever? Or It's probably like a big mega corporation that oversees all this stuff. Submarine. I got hit into these holes, right? Over here, I'm assuming. What the 
Heck. Um. Did you know they don't make the fruity, uh, the Flintstones push pops anymore? Um. I remember that being like a childhood favorite, but the Flintstones branding is like long gone. I guess like only the the pebble cereals still have like the Flintstones on them. A lot of kids don't even know like the Flintstones really. They just know uh the fruity pebble mascots. Oh, cheese sticks. I honestly I I love cheese sticks. I don't eat them very often cuz they're not like good for you and they're like overpriced for what they are, but they're tasty. Lightsaber is owned by Mars. I see. Is that, but is but is post cereals owned by Mars as well? Maybe maybe this is multi corporate sponsored. I don't know. Because there's craft as well. I assume this is one big corporation, but I could be wrong. How deep, do, how far does the rabbit hole go with this stuff? I don't know. The craft, fruity pebbles, life savers, iceberg. Come on, get over there. <laughs> Dang. There we go. Nice. What's this one? Oh! He's like caramel chocolate something? I can't tell. Let's do this. Yeah, here we go. Oh, get in there, get in there! Oh, that was almost a hole-in-one. I've been so extraordinarily lucky if I had two hole-in-ones tonight. Oh, seems to be a little thing. So this is actually is multi-corporate sponsored. I didn't realize that. Yeah. Okay. Um. So, yeah. I mean, they had multiple uh updates where they have different games and stuff. So here's Nabisco World Mini Golf. Uh, definitely much nicer looking at UI this time. So, but this is all gonna be N Nabisco type stuff, I guess. What's this advertising? Exactly. Owners could have changed. Yeah, I guess. But I mean, we still see the Lifesavers brandings on this thing. This is still Lifesavers candy stand or whatever. Gosh darn it. <laughs> I'm sucking. Hey, less, diff less hard this time. There we go. Oh, and I still screwed it up. Hold on, let me just restart. Let's try again. Minty lifesavers. I guess so. Those are like the best lifesavers though, aren't they? Like the mint flavor. Like, they call like cool mints or winto greens or whatever. Winto greens are freaking amazing. Oh gosh. This is actually really challenging. Okay. I'm just I'm just getting desperate here. Like what can, what angle do I need to hit this at? That like that. There we go. You're a normal lightsaber fan? Well, fair. Yeah. Um, me, nowadays, the only ones I would eat are the, uh, Lifesavers gummies. Everything else is, like, too hard on my teeth now. Like, uh, especially, like, having the hard candy in your mouth for so long, it can, like, cause a major amount of tooth decay, so I'm just like, nah, I don't think so. Oh, this one's really hard. I remember this. These... If if you're if the ball gets stuck on any of these pistons or whatever, 
they'll t totally knock them out of play. So this is actually a really, really challenging course. And I already screwed up. Um, I kind of just want to hit it up there. And then I have to hit, get it across very slowly. Or not all at once, so you know. I can't do like one hit. Gosh. It's like either I hit it not enough or too much. Yeah, look at that. Okay, there, 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 there. Stay, 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 stay. Stay right there. Okay, okay. You love Mentos of flavor, but not mints. Oh, fair. Um, when I was a kid, my parents would actually... Dang it. They would actually grow, grow fresh mint themselves, you know. To put in their tea and stuff. It was very delicious. You could also just eat it plain if you wanted. It's a bit strong, but you never know. It'd be good. By the way, do you recognize what this music is from? You may not be able to guess it if you've never played this game. Dang it. No, 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 no. Don't run. You've got to be kidding me. I'm all the way down here again. Okay. I really got to get it down there. Because this is my last shot, I think. Oh, I put too much power in. Oh, I have one more. Okay. I think that was the limit. Oh, yeah. So this music is from uh, Sonic Unleashed. One of my favorite games, really. Actually, it's two games. It's not even just one. There's a there's a version for 360 and PS3, and there's one for PS2 and Wii. And they're two separate games. I wouldn't mind playing either one of them on stream, but I think the only one I can't do right now is like the PS2 slash Wii one. You could... Oh, I see. If I put my ball on the um on the X there I think wait wait I don't, I don't want to hit it this hard I'm too late now can't undo this okay oh you've got to be kidding me that was such a troll I was open for like a split second but I think the balloon will drop it straight into the hole for me there we go. Yeah, come on. Put in the hole. Oh no, wait, I have to I have to click it, that's right. I have to click it to get in the hole. Alright. Just tap this, just tap it. Of course it's still not enough strength. Oh well. Wait, 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 this is the same one. Okay, I can I don't need to do this one. I already did that. Ooh. Actually I think it's bad to get it underneath the UFO. You definitely don't want the UFO to get this and this one, right? And there's Nessie, I guess, over there. I did not expect it to bounce like that. Okay, okay, okay. Out of the range of the UFO, I assume, right? Yeah. Oh, I don't want to hit this hard. Oh, no. I can't undo this. Oh, great. Uh, well. Here goes nothing, I guess. Oh, jeez. Okay, I gotta get out. I gotta get out from underneath this UFO quick. Oh, wait, wait, come on, come on, come on, come on, move, 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 move. No. Ah, uh, too slow.
I may need to restart this one from scratch. Alright, let's go. Get in there. No! Get in there. Uh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay, I'm safe, right? Yeah, I'm safe. Okay. Oh, that was challenging. Okay, I've done that one. Which somehow, miraculously, only took me two shots. Whoa. I didn't see that that thing was there until... Yeah, I hit it. Now, getting a ball up these little hills is tough, though. I'll admit that, because either you... It has the really bad problem of hitting it too hard or too soft or whatever. There we go. Three's the par, cool. Did that one. Does Nabisco own lifesavers or something? Because it said Nabisco World Mini Golf. But I don't know. I'm very confused with all this branding. Can I get it in there from here? No, of course not. Even though this thing is 2D technically. Um, it still has like 3D logic. Oh, brilliant. That was brilliant on my part. Um, okay, so I think that's enough mini golf. Let's look at what other kinds of games they had back then. There's a whole bunch of these games that I don't recognize because they were beyond my time. Like, I don't remember Lifesavers Mini Motocross. What the heck is this? Looks like it could be cool, though. Let's look at it. Uh, I have to resize the window here. That's another 16x9 game. Uh, green apple, orange, strawberry, pepo mint, cherry. Okay. I guess it gotta be strawberry. But how do you play this? What are the controls? Okay, I'm using my mouse, right? Yeah. Oh, this thing's got music. Okay, hold on, hold on. How do I get the music? What? Hold on, let me, let me turn off the music here. I'll start over. Okay. Let's go. Man, we're fucking tiny, man. We really are many. Holy cow. Honey, I shrunk the kids type stuff here going on. Yeah, no, why are we tiny? Oh, I can, I can, if I, if I press the button, I think I can do a wheelie, maybe? Wow. Okay, that was... I think this might be an infinite runner, because I don't think there's, like, an ending to any of this or anything. Maybe there is. No, wait, there is, because it says lap one of three. But I gotta keep the gasoline. This is kind of like River Raid or whatever. Do you even know what the hell River Raid is? Well, anyway. Oh, get it, get it. Oh, shoot. Stupid cat, get out of my way. Oh, wait. Oh, I thought, I thought I was the one up down there. I couldn't tell who I was for a second there. Ah, uh, I need to get more gasoline. 
Alright, there we go. Yeah, there we go. The controls on this are just kind of weird, honestly. They're, they don't feel very precise at all. But I mean, it's mouse control, so what can you say? I'm steering with the mouse. Oh, shoot. What? Wow. Okay, uh, let's look at this. What says help? Uh... The text is so tiny, I'm having to lean in. Cause damage. I don't know. That game's kind of cool. But... Yeah, the controls are... not ideal. Let's see, what else we got? Oh, we got some bowling. Do some freaking bowling. Okay. Uh, gotta resize this again. I guess that's sort of centered, maybe a little bit. Anyway. Orange and cream, raspberries and cream. I'll just do strawberry and cream. Okay. Oh, brilliant. That was amazing. Let's see if I can shoot straight this time. Hey, not bad. See, you can actually adjust the angle of the ball if you want by uh, moving slightly left or right, but you don't want to overdo it like I did there. I'll just kind of slowly roll. Oh, what? Why did, why did it veer off to the left? That doesn't seem, <laughs> that doesn't seem physically possible. What the heck? I guess you do have to put in some force. I'm just afraid when I put in the force that I'm going to accidentally veer to the left or the right and go get another gutter ball like I did. There we go. Yeah, they got some like freaking sticky floors, I'm sure. Of course, of course. See, like, that's what I mean. I I went slightly to the left, and then I got a full gutter ball, because I... My mouse loop moved slightly to the left. Let's go. Oh, shoot! I didn't mean to do that. But it actually worked? It actually worked. Okay. Brilliant. Okay. Always leaving this spare pin every time and then failing to hit it. Oh no, that's terrible. Wow. I'm seriously having some skill issues today. Perfectly timed. Commentary there. All right, let's get this. Get it. 
get it, get it. Yeah, there we go. Finally a spare. So then I get one more shot. Alright. Make it count. Oh, uh, okay. 91. 91. That's not amazing. Yeah. Oh well. Pretty fun. Driving range? There's a... There's a driving range game. Hell, let's try it. I don't think I've ever played this one, ever. I think that's good enough, centered. Um... What does it- wonder what the difference is, ladies' tea or men's tea? Uh, I wonder what the difference is. I guess just their character. Every character is just a man or a woman. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Model, right? Okay, uh... This is taking an, an absurd amount of time to load because, um... It shouldn't have to download anything. It should be just on my uh, SSD right now. So I don't understand why. I'm st I'm stuck at this loading screen. I don't think I'm going to get to play this one, unfortunately. Yeah. I think it's broken. Unfortunate. Um. Hmm. It's a darts game. Like, all the classic, uh, you know, bar games are here. Home Run Rally. Okay, let's try that. Oh, I accidentally started a new game. I didn't mean to. Okay, so how do I do this? Oh, I can't see what I did. Uh, I actually clicked out of the window. What? What? Wait, get out. I'm so confused right now. Oh, brilliant. Okay. I wonder if, I wonder if I, there's a way to adjust my batting angle at all. Nope. Of course. Of course, of course. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, why am I sucking so bad? Whoop. I can't hit anything now. Get out of my way. I keep, I accidentally keep bringing up the menu. Not intending to. I guess the I guess if you click on that backboard back there then you get the thing. You get the menu. Let's see. Uh oh. the shoulder bat. Release button to hit ball. Fling mouse upward. Drive ball low to high. Okay. So I need to I need to fling more. I need to fling my mouse more. That's my problem. There we go. Hell yeah. Whoop. I'm really, really slow on these reactions. Too soon. Whoop, oh, shoot. Nope. What would that be? Well, that would probably get you at least a double, right? Maybe. Whoop. Oh. Hey, nice.
Well, this game is kind of kick ass, honestly. Whoops. Game over. Start again. This is the really fun part of baseball games anyway, so. Yeah. Damn, I'm just destroying so much property. I guess with my MLB salary, it's okay though. This is pretty great. All these people are just loving all the destruction. It's great. This, this is as American as it gets, really. Well, bounce into the stadiums there. Um, yeah, they were pay they were paid that well back in then. Um, I mean, they're not going to be as high as as pay they're paid now, but this if this is like the late '90s to the 2000s. I mean, this I think it's post strike era, right? Like they had the big strike somewhere in the mid '90s. I thought maybe it was like the latter '90s. They renegotiated salaries and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, I do know that. Baseball players make the least of the three major sports. Like, you know, football is number one. Basketball is like they second, and then I think baseball players make the least of the three. But I mean, it's still like millions of dollars for playing a game, so it's still pretty freaking sweet, man. Oh, shoot. I'm sucking. Come on. Too slow. Too slow. There we go. Nice. This is like the most hype game I've played, for sure. <laughs> this is great. Ah. Uh. Is that gonna make it? Nah. They still got the ball though, in the in the stands. Oop. Yeah. No. Not like this. I don't want to go out like this. Nice. Not in this game, I guess. It's a home run derby, so I don't know. Is that is that 475 yards or, well, something? Like, because that's pretty impressive. That's some mighty arms, man. Oops. Picked off the window again. Whoop. Ah, oh, shoot. I got robbed there. I clicked off the window. Uh, how did I do? 14 runs. In total. Oh, I see. I see. In total. Okay. That was a really cool game. I had a blast with that. I don't think I ever played it back in the day, because back in the day, I used to be, like, very judgmental towards sports. Um, I was just, like, a nerd, and I was like, I don't like sports, or something like that. But no, that was actually really fun. I didn't know what I was missing. 
Apparently they did a Sonic branded game here. Lifesaver Sonic Pinball. Wonder what the controls are gonna be. One player. Oh wow, they're actually using like the Sega Genesis sound effects. Okay. But this would have been like late 90s or 2000s or something when this game was made but for the website. So yeah, these are like, I don't know, like maybe some kids would have had a Genesis in this time even so though, because people got hand-me-down consoles and stuff. Hand me down video games. Plus, there was that Sonic Mega collection on like GameCube and stuff. That was very popular with kids. That was unfortunate. Oh, shoot. Oh. Uh... The only unfortunate thing is that as I'm playing this, I'm just thinking like the graphics are so tiny. But it's it's not that the graphics are tiny. It's just that um, at the time that this game was made, resolutions were much lower. So, like, you would have been playing, like, an 800 by 600 screen or something on a CRT. Although, on your screen, it's gonna look fine, I'm sure, because I did blow it up on OBS. I do think this is not the most amazing pinball table design ever. I should play Space Cadet sometime. That's like everyone's favorite nostalgic uh, PC pinball game. But I also want to play 3D Ultra Pinball too. At some point. Well, that sucked. Hit it after he died. I hit him after he died. That's interesting. Where's he gonna come from? Oh yeah, from, cause he just comes straight out of there. I'm not even doing anything at this point, he's just doing that on his own. it, right? Well, I guess I was alright. I wasn't amazing, though. Okay. Hmm, how long have I been streaming now? Almost an hour, damn.
Yeah, there's there's lots of games on here I don't I don't recognize. Dentine Ice and Dentine Fire. I guess Dentine Ice is still a thing, right? What else we got? Another bike game. Let's look at this. Okay. This is definitely the one, it has to be one of the early games because look at these uh, low res graphics and stuff. How do I play this? Wait, wait, wait. How do I control this dude? I can't really steer him left or right. I guess, oh wait, I was, maybe I click buttons to make him do tricks or something? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Reset. Info. How to play. First, plan your jumps. Okay. Click on your rider, begin your approach. Huh? Press and hold mouse button while pedaling down the start ramp. Okay. Oh, more flinging the mouse. Okay. Move the cursor in one of these seven zones of the screen to initiate a trick. Oh, okay. This sounds like it's gonna be like pretty difficult, so let's go back. Uh, let's try this again. Whoop, script error. Big thing crashed. Uh, yeah. Oh, it didn't crash. But yeah. Yeah, I figured that was going to happen. Script error? Why does it keep doing that? Click too hard, yeah. Yeah, I think so. I think I'm flicking it too hard or something. Let's see here. I can't do any of these tricks, man. Like... This is pretty challenging. I try not to fling it too hard or anything, but. Yeah, I don't get it. I, I can't get that game to really work for me. Um, more mini golf. Whoa. That's definitely way later. There's a whole bunch of other branding stuff. Oh, I don't mean to do that. Oh, that's like another home run rally. I think it's the same one, just rebranded. Alfonso Soriano. He has the same name as you. Well, first name. Imposter, yes. One. Resize already. Dang it. Make bigger. Bigger. Okay. Look at all this. Look at all this nonsense. There's like Sony and stuff all over this. Um. Play the game score under par to enter to win. A Sony Psych T Walkman player with wear headphones. I wonder who won. 
wonder who the lucky kid was. Maybe it was like an adult stealing it from kids. Well, probably isn't me though. Probably not gonna be me here. I don't think I'm gonna get this CD Walkman. There we go. Oh, oh, I just if I can just get this in two more shots, I'll have it, right? Which way should I shoot it? I maybe go this way. Bounce it over there. Oh, of course I bounced it the wrong way. Nah, I'm not getting that Sony CD Walkman, unfortunately. Oh my god! Ugh. No, no CD Walkman. Let me try this again. Play every day for a chance to win. These were hard times, man. Everybody was desperate to get their CD Walkmans then. Play their new burn CDs with their Napster MP3s. Oh, 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 I have a chance. I can win. I can win the Sony Walkman. Hold on. I can get it. Oh, well. Thanks for telling me now. Great. Okay, well, I'll finish it off with uh, some Alfonso baseball here. I think it's just going to be the same game as before, but, you know, that's fine because it's fun. So. Yeah, like, that's such a jip, man. Like, how they- why did they tell you that before you started playing? Anyway. Oh. Oh. I click- I have to keep from clicking on the signboard. It's even big- it seems like it's even bigger than before this time. Oh, gosh. The Lifesavers Fusions? Do they still make those? Oh, goodness. Yeah, off to a great start, of course. No more destroying cars outside, though. Sayonara. Sayonara. Yeah, it is the same game. That's cool. I like the little, yeah, the little animations going on back there. It's cool. No, see, the distance is actually per hit. So I hit it like, I think it's 570 feet, I guess. Ah, uh, shoot. I'm sucking. Come on, come on, come on. Get it. Can I hit the blimp? That'd be amazing if I can bounce it off the blimp. I don't think that's possible, though. This kid continues in 02, so damn, this really dates it. 01. So this must be made like year 2000 or something. Oh, come on. Out of the park. Yeah.
How many swings do I have left? Does it say? Oh, I still have 13. Damn, I have like a ton. I guess it's okay if I whiff some then. I wonder if I can, uh, yeah, I guess I can beat my record from last time. Well, well, not if I do that. I think I had 15 before. Oh, no, I'm, I'm gonna mess it up. I'm not gonna get, I'm not gonna beat my score. Oh, no. I'm choking. There we go. Oh, is that a foul or something? Yeah, that didn't count. Oh, that sucks. Lifesavers minis. I don't think I've ever remember seeing Lifesavers minis ever. Uh. No, I... <laughs> I feel pressured to succeed, and I think that's why I'm failing. Oh no, another foul ball. Whoops. Hey, there we go, there's some destruction, finally. Actually, I think there was some destruction already, I just didn't comment on it. Well. This is it. This is my last chance. And of course. Okay. Well, that was pretty fun. Um, I'm going to go eat now, though. Um, so, I'm a bit hungry. This was great, though. It was great just going down memory lane, playing some of these freaking ancient games. Yeah. Bye. Yeah, I'll see you later, man. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, see ya.